Jesse, give us a demo. No way. Team approval? No, we're not doing it. Hell no. Back foot was first. What the hell is that? It's the most split I've ever done. Front back. What? 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 On the stand up. I'm not saying wrong with that. What did he say? Front back. Oh. No, I got that just me. Yeah. How do you split on the opposite side? Can I just do wall on the same side? Yeah, I, yeah, always. Nah, I mean, back, front, front, back won't make any difference. <laughs> <laughs> oh, honestly, I will try, and then just whatever happens, happens. Same side. <laughs> Pretty sure. That's what it's gonna be. Tommy's coming. So now we're all gonna get beaten. If there's ever a time I can beat Tommy, he just got back off holiday, so maybe today's the day. <laughs> follow, follow, follow the leader. It is, that's correct, it's just not, it's not uh, technically perfect. But yes, you 100% will be able to do that. And, and, and I'll probably be doing that at some point because... But I figure my problem is, is like if you don't touch the ground, right? It's so hard to repeat. Yeah, well Like, because I could do like this. Yeah. But then the next time I might just like short split it. So that there's no measurability for what the split should be. But it's not. It's a, it's a way to jumping lunge from the floor. Yeah. That's actually probably the perfect way to describe it. Yeah. It's a front rack weighted jumping lunge from the floor. <laughs> Alright, we have to try and figure out this. Front rack weighted jumping lunge from the floor, also known as a dumbbell split clean. We're thinking the goal will be to always make sure our back knee touches the ground because then we can repeat it. Sometimes you can short split a split so then it's not repeatable. So trying to keep that repeating fashion going. There's a few of us today. We have Jesse, we have Judith, who's a veteran trust fitter. <laughs> We have Evan, who's brand new, first day. We got Tommy back on the scene. Yeah. And we got Pete, man, the bit the legend. We got Tommy looking up. Yeah, that's the one that I watched. Yeah. That had the people doing it with the. Oh what? Yeah. So it's just like a clean, but with a lunch. It's like a clean with a lunch. Yeah. Yeah, there it is. Boom. That looks horrible. <laughs> that no rip that one, I reckon. I reckon. Yeah. So I'm thinking like the standard would be touch the dumbbells to the ground. Five heads. I mean, always as hard as possible. Down, split, lunge, recover. Down, split. And the, the trick would have to be to not, not do this, and then bring them down like before I've recovered. So there's like a, make sure I hit the recovery, and then go down. It'd be very easy to fuck that up when I'm very tired. <laughs> I reckon by the end of it, might be stepping the field. Yeah. Oh yeah, I think you might be right there, Pete. Look at this guy. He's not touching the ground. Yeah, well they demo it not touching the ground. Well, let's do that. Nah, fuck that. <laughs> Always hard as possible. Shit, we here and no idea. Let me back. Sorry, I did not mean to say that. <laughs> There we go. A few of us today, got a couple of ladies down the top there. We've got Evan, myself and Tommy over here. And the Pete's gonna be behind the camera. All right, so today we're gonna to do Aaron. It is five rounds for time of 40 pound dumbbells. So multiple dumbbells, split clean, 15 reps, 21 pull-ups. Canadian Army Master Corporal Aaron Doyle, 32, was killed in a firefight August 11, 2008 in the Panjwai District. Kandahar province, Afghanistan. He survived by his wife, Nicole, and his daughter, Zani. Looks like a bit of badass on this photo. The pull-ups are pretty easy. The dumbbell split clean, we're gonna go, basically the hardest option we can manage. We're going both heads of the dumbbell on the ground, into the front rack, through us, basically a jump lunge. 
uh, knee touching the ground and then standing back up before we bring it back down. Simply because that's the only one we can repeat and there's no other harder option. So if we ever think we've done it correctly, we've done it the hardest possible way initially. Uh, there is a video of people doing it kind of like that. But we'll see how we go. Probably take somewhere in that 20 minute range, uh, depending on how hard these cleans are. Tommy's back in holidays. Ed's back off night shift. Judas is back in black. <laughs> Should be fun. Tommy's going luxury. Yeah. He's got the luxury, the luxury lunge setup with the with the razor sharp knee, the telly insertions.
see that view where it's like it's attached to the person and everything looks weird? It's like, ah, the workout's terrible. <laughs> Apparently you can do it like this. Yeah, Post workout well, interview. Dumbbells. How was it, boys? That was tough. Gassy. Yeah, yeah, fun. I need to come back a little bit because Evan's in frame. Yeah. I'm going to zoom back out. Do the What do you reckon? Cardio done? Cardio done. Excellent. Back to bodybuilding. Tommy. Pretty good. Pretty good. Back into training. Yeah. The uh, dumbbells were an interesting movement. I don't think I've done them before and I've been here for like seven years. So. I've been training for like 14 years. I've had done. Pretty good workout. Let's be making good class workout, I reckon. Pretty scalable, pretty... Very scalable. And there it is. Day number 15 out of 206. There's one. There's two. Probably it would be easier. <laughs> it would be easier. Maybe more just to get. Oh my god, my eyeballs. Oh god. <laughs> you got one in, the other one's. Oh, there you go. See, I reckon. Right, like, one, two, one, two, one. Oh, fuck. Oh, no, 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 I'm not even gonna try it. I thought, like, if you do it out of the headset. Do you reckon you could release for just the hand sample shop and then re-correct at the top? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure. That'll totally work. Ah, shit. See, that's not. See, you've got one, you've got a round, like, in there. Your legs aren't the same. What is this? Oh, can you do it? Can you kit into catch? Just... <laughs> this is fucking insane. This is one. Ah! One. Twenty four to go. <laughs> I fucking hate you, Tony. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's still filming. <laughs> Oh man! Okay. Yeah, I'm good. Dude, that first one was like sick, man. How many of you in 75. Production interview, here we go. <laughs> Competition on the weekend. Yes. Where'd you come? We came ninth Ooh. out of 13, which was good. Better Big than fish. we thought. Uh, yeah, better Favorite than event? last. Favorite event would have been the last one, which was the rope, climb. rope climbs, uh, rope climbs, muscle ups, snake lunges, and overhead squats. Yeah, it was good. Uh, we did well. Uh, we yeah, we smashed those uh, rope climbs, yes. which was good. Um, yeah, there was some other events that were hard. Um, what was the kayaking? Just had to do a little run to kind of stagger the start, and then we just had to... Ryan had his drone, so he like was able to work out the distance. I think it was about a K, oh, cool. K kayak, which we did well. We went straight and everyone was going zigzagging, so... Yeah, was, yeah. Yeah. yeah, so it was good. Excellent. Um, yeah, we did well. I think we came like third in that event. Oh, nice. So, Was that your top finish? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Um, yeah. 